Hey, welcome back to another Raised by Wolves Gaming episode. Back with another Destiny 2 Forsaken weapon review. Almost time for Black Armory. And I finally got the Trinity Ghoul after a day where I had two exotics drop for me. One, an exotic sparrow that I already had. And the other was a tractor cannon that I've had for over a year now. I was pretty frustrated until I got this one to drop for me. Doing some strikes. This has split electron. Fires an arrow that splits when released. Aiming down sights and fully drawing the bow both decrease the spread. It has high tension string, compact arrow shaft, and lightning rod. Precision kills grant the next shot chain lightning capabilities. And I got the tangled outrider ornament. Actually the first ornament that I got in Forsaken. And it took me this long to get this bow. But I'm pretty excited about it. I guess the squeaky wheel gets the grease. Because I whined about not getting new exotics. And now I got one. So we're going to jump on into some PvP and some PvE. I want to see what this thing can do in both. Let's jump into the action. All right, here we go. We got some Gambit with this thing, the Trinity Ghoul. Fire split arrows. I want to get a precision shot so I can change... Oh, wait. <laughs> I'm so used to it being the uh, the ruins on the first one that I just ran to the wrong place. Okay, give me a break. You jerk. Can I get a precision shot? There we go. Now we can chain some lightning. Where are some enemies that can chain lightning to? Nowhere. I'm not going to waste my shot. I still have this lightning rod effect. Apparently it lasts forever, which is cool. Okay, there's some group of enemies over there. Let's try it. Oh, look at all the damage. I like it. And then that worked. And then we're going to chain some lightning again. Cool. Very cool. Don't know that it's doing a ton of damage, but, you know, it, it's cool. It's cool. Hey, you, back there. Take a headshot. All right, we got our lightning rod again. Oh, you guys want some? There's another one. Cool, 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 cool. All right, well, that's fun. I want to see... I want to see how this thing spreads if I don't pull it back all the way. Huh. Okay. Well, that's a thing. Now, you can see all three bolts hit there. Did 86, 86, 86. That's kind of cool. Um, probably need something for a little burst damage. I wasn't really thinking through my options here. But whatever. Let's get a let's get a precision shot and then we'll chain some lightning. Oh no, no. Exit out. Okay, good, 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 good. I suppose I should probably bank these moats. I'm running around like I haven't a care in the world. Nobody would ever invade us, right? I like your style. Oh, I missed my shot. I was trying to be like an epic uh, thing and it, it didn't work. But that would work. That that was cool. Throw that there. Get electrocuted, bro. Going full electricity today. Got the Arc Strider. Got the Trinity Ghoul. Arc Bolt Grenades. That's how. Oh, get over there. Inbound at the beach. Okay, well, I guess we better bank and get our primeval going, right? All right, let's go over here. We're gonna headshot this guy. Not that guy. That guy. Yeah. And that guy. Invader incoming. And chain lightning. Oh, look at that! How far it chained. That was really cool. I like it. Portals up. Go look them in the eyes. Your ally neutralized the invader. Primeval compromised. Focus your fire. You know what? Let's get up here. We'll use our super. And take out these on boys. There we go. That's what we needed to do. Let's get that envoy down. Alright. Well, that worked. Prime Evil's down. Nice. So, PvE, this could be fun. It could be really fun in strikes, I think. Okay, here we go. We got control on Endless Veil. 
with the Trinity Ghoul. I would really love to get a headshot kill and then do some work with this lightning rod thing. Not sure if we'll be able to, but... Oh, we got a headshot dink, but not a kill. Somebody's got to be coming this way, right? Oh, there he is. God dang it. Freaking Titans and your special moves. Ugh. So I have started leveling my Titan. Just just to mix things up. Getting tired of playing the old Hunter for a second. Oh, that was 249s there. Oh, we got the assist. Oh my god in heaven. Oh. Oh my god, they're all... What the hell? Don't be captured. You have advantage. Okay, I'll take that. Take that. Oh no. Ooh. Ooh. Oh no. Zone A. Come on down. There we go. Now we got the lightning rod. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> nice. Didn't have anybody to chain it to, but that was nice. I liked it. Okay, he's weak. Oh no, get down, get down here, hunter. Don't jump away like you hunters do. Got him. Nice. Oh no! You're dead. Oh my god, as soon as I release the block, I get killed. I'm the worst. Oh, no! I wanted the kill. Zone B captured. Zone advantage is yours. Zone A lost. Yes, got it. Power play. Chain lightning. Let's go. You captured zone C. Okay, gotta find a place where there's some enemies. No. Fudge! Yes, got it. All right, let's find a spot where there's multiple enemies together, preferably on a control point, so I can chain lightning. No, not this guy again. You have zone advantage. Okay, they're coming up to the control point. Hey, it worked. No. No. Oh. Well, that was short-lived. <laughs> wow, the blast radius on that is ridiculous. There's a dink. I got it! I'm dead! Ha! Oh, I got suppressed anyway, huh? Well, I'm dead. Likely dead. Yeah. Wow, that that was bad. That was really not good, in fact. So, initial thoughts on the Trinity Ghoul. It's pretty fun in PvE. In PvP, the draw time is really slow. Uh, you're not going to get any one-shot kills with this thing, so you're going to need to hit multiple times or soften them up with something else and then switch to this. Or... I don't know, hope that your teammates have knocked somebody's shields down enough that you can one-shot them with this. And then you get the Chain Lightning, which, again, in PvE, works pretty well. In PvP, I'm not exactly sure how much damage it does, because in the one match I've played so far, didn't really have much of a chance to use it. Probably going to change up my loadout a little bit here, just to see if I can get something to synergize a little bit better with it. But, uh, yeah, I'm glad I got it. It's an exotic. I didn't have it. It looks pretty cool. So I'm going to jump back into the Crucible, mess around with some things, and see what I can do with the Trinity Ghoul.
could not ask for a better picture. <laughs>